Another fun activity you can do to practice dropping and have some fun is if you grab a can, like an old coffee can, and ask your grown-up for help to cut a hole in the middle, and then you can use something like sticks or Q-tips or pom-poms or beads and throw them down. Ready? Let's drop it. Whoa! Do it again with this green one. Fun! How about this red one? Ooh, I like that. And then something else you could do is if you have little headbands or you can cut these out of a piece of paper and stick them on. Bok, 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 bok. But you can pretend the can is an animal. This is my little chicken. Bok, 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 bok. Do you have any red sticks? Oh, chicken, we do. Oh, I would like to have one, please. Here you go, chicken. Yum, 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 yum. Can I have another one, please? Sure, chicken. Yum, 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 yum. May I have one more? Of course, chicken. Yum, 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 yum. I'm all full. Thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. Let's see what other headbands we have. Oh, how about this one? Nay, 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 a horse. Let's turn this can into a little horsey. Hey, horse, nay, nay. Do you have any purple sticks? We do, let's see. Here's a purple stick. Let's put it in. Yum, 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 yum. May I have another one, please? Of course. Here you go, ready? In. Yum, 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 yum. May I have one more? Of course. Here you go. In. Yum, yum, yum. I'm all full. I'm so happy to hear that horse. Ooh, I got another one. I'm a cow. Moo. Moo. We'll turn our little can into a cow. Here we go. Moo! Oh, do you have any green sticks? We do. May I have one, please? Oh, absolutely, cow. Here we go. We'll put it in. Yum, 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 yum. Let's do another one. Let's put it in. Yum, 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 yum. And another one. <gasps> yum, 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 yum. I'm all full. Thank you. Oh, that might be too many. I might need you one at a time. Oh, but two. Oh, yum, yum. Yum, yum. Burp. Wow. Okay, this is going to be your potty, chicken. I'm going to go try. <laughs> toot, toot, beep, beep, boop, boop. I did it. Wipe, wipe, flush. I did it. I'm ready to eat again. Yum, yum. Here's another fun activity you can play at home. You just need to set up some bins or you can even play this in the bath or outside. If you're playing inside, make sure to set a towel underneath so nothing spills. If you fill this one up with water, you can put little ducks in and have a duck race. Put them in. And if you get a spray bottle, when we spray our ducks, they're gonna start swimming. Ready? Let's cheer our ducks on. You ready for some duck races? Let's do it! Swim, swim, little ducky! Oh, wow! Great swimming. Now let's spray another one. Swim, swim! Swim, swim! Go, little ducky! Let's set up another duck race. I've got a pink ducky an orange ducky, and a blue one. And let's spray them together, ready? You go, little duckies! Go, go, go! All right! Go, little ducky, here it goes! Wait, this is this thing, so yeah. the water now. That is where the water's coming out from, that's right. Mm-hmm. 
And if you point it towards the duckies, that's what makes them go swim, swim, swim. Ooh. You go, duckies! Yeah! There goes your duckies and they're swimming, keep spraying. Go, little duckies, go! Another fun activity you can do is if you get a little strainer sifter like this, and we can help rescue the duckies out of their water. Put it in, take the ducky out, and I'll put it in the dry bin. Get another one, wow! Here you go, little ducky. Here we go, and another one, wow, a blue ducky. Look at how many ducks we're helping. All right, thank you for playing with me. Here we go. Here's a fun activity you can do at home if you ask your owner for help. You can put some contact paper. It's called contact paper and it's sticky on one side, but not the other. And you can tape it to the wall with the sticky part out. And then if you put something like a butterfly behind it, you can do a really cute butterfly design. I cut up some pieces of paper with all the different colors and then we can put it all around and design our own butterfly. Ready? Here we go. I'll put a purple piece. And, ooh, what about a green one? An orange one. Ooh, pink one here. A red one. Another orange one. How about this piece? Let's put this red piece here. Here we go. Here we go. This is gonna be a very cute butterfly. Baby says, I wanna try, I wanna try. Okay, here we go. You pick up a piece and then stick it on. Pick up, ooh, a green piece. Stick it on. Let's put on another purple piece. Orange piece. Here's a fun little reindeer craft you can do at home and all you need is a candy cane, some red pom-poms for a nose, googly eyes, and some brown pipe cleaners for antlers. Let's make it together. First, we'll use a little sticky and add this little red pom-pom as a cute nose for a little reindeer. Let's see. We'll put it right at the tip, boop, right at the tip of the nose, boop. And then let's add two eyes. And then how about some antlers? I'll wrap the pipe cleaner around. There we go. And then let's spin them, spin them. So they're fun and curly. I'll wrap it around my finger and then let go and curl up those antlers. <gasps> Look at this little reindeer, it says, hello. <gasps> hello, little reindeer. Hello, little reindeer. Merry Christmas. Oh, look, when I put two candy canes together, it makes a little heart. A little reindeer kiss. Here's a little reindeer kiss for you. Uh, okay, here's a candy cane. Okay, here, I'll peel this little sticky off for you, and you can put this on the end. That's cute. And then here's one eye. Whoa. Yeah. I can see. Now I can go see. 
And then I'll wrap this around. And these could be the little antlers. I'll twirl them, twirl them like this. Oh, hello! Um, a friend. Hello, so nice to meet you, friend. Whoa, we love your antlers. I also like the ones that you have. Thank you so much for saying that. Did you see the snowman and all of the nutcrackers? Yeah. How fun. I want some music. Oh, let's turn on some music. Hey, Mr. Snowman, do you know how to play your trumpet? Yeah. That's beautiful. <gasps> boop, 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 boop. Do you need one more candy cane and you're gonna make another friend? Should we friend? make one more? Yeah. I want another friend. You do, Reindeer? Here, we can make another one. Here's another friend. Okay, where should we stick this nose? You wanna do it? Yeah. Turn it like in the middle. Okay, I have one eye. I'll stick him on the side. Good idea. I want to see. Here, I'll put these around. Mommy, I'm gonna do this go other one. Go ahead, go ahead. Did you twirl that all on your own? Yeah. <gasps> Whoa, hello other reindeer. I We're so have... happy you're here. We all jump around. Yay! Reindeer hopping, reindeer hopping! <laughs> Here's another fun activity you can do at home if you print out a picture of a sheep. <laughs> Or you can draw one, and then what we're gonna do is stick these cotton balls to make our sheep really fluffy. If you have a glue stick, you can put the glue stick on and then stick these on. Or something else you can do is if you ask grown up for help, they can help you cut this part out. Let's cut it out together. Let's see. Here we go. And if you put tape on the back of it, it'll make it sticky. Here we go. Now this part of the sheep is sticky. Let's put our cotton balls on. Here's one. Let's stick some more. Let's put more cotton balls on. Here's one more here. And another one. 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 Oh, wow. Look how fluffy our sheep is. Bah, bah. Thank you for helping me. Hey, sheep, you want to go see if we can see a rainbow? Yeah. Yeah, come on, sheep. Sheep says, bah. Bah. Good bawing. Yeah, it was good bawing, huh? Let's go, sheep. Let's go see if we can see a rainbow. Here's another fun activity you can play at home with your puzzle. It's called hide and seek. It's fun to play hide and seek with people where you go find a spot, hide, and then somebody comes and finds you. They're seeking you. And you can also play it with your toys where you take puzzle pieces and we'll kind of set them in different areas. And they're gonna be hiding, hiding. Here you go, baby. I'll put you over here. And we'll hide the animals. Then baby will come back and try to find them. We go. And you can play it on shelves and hide the animals or the puzzle pieces on the shelf. You can also hide them in your couch and play hide and seek with your toys. Okay, so I'll leave this here and then we'll have baby come and find them. Hello, hello, I'm ready to play. Okay, all of the pieces are hiding and so now let's go find them. Hmm, oh, oh, I found an alligator. Let's put him back. All right, let's see who else is hiding. Ooh, I see a hippo right over here. Let's put it back in. And stomp, stomp, stomp. Oh, look, an elephant was hiding behind there. Let's put the elephant back in. 
All right, let's see who else we can find. Hmm. Do you see anybody? What about down here? Here's a zebra we found. Let's put the zebra back in the puzzle. In. All right, who else is hiding, hiding? I'll check this basket. Oh, wow, a rhino. Let's put the rhino in. Here we go. Let's see, I'm looking for somebody with a long neck. <gasps> Here it is, here's a giraffe. Let's put giraffe back in the puzzle. Looks like we've got two pieces left, a lion and an ostrich. Let's check this basket. Oh wow, we found the lion. Let's put lion in. And we've got one piece left. Hmm, let's see where we can look. Let's turn this puzzle. <gasps> An ostrich was hiding in there. Let's put ostrich back in. Do you see other puzzle pieces? I found a giraffe. Yahoo! Stomp, stomp, stomp. You found it. Find the spot in the puzzle. You found it. Nice. I found it the rainbow. I found it the Good job. You're a good helper and a great friend. <laughs> Here's a fun activity you can play at home. If you have a puzzle, and it can be any puzzle, we'll use a farm puzzle today. But you can do ABCs or animals or cars or anything else. We'll put them in this bin and cover it up with rice. You can also use sand or oatmeal, or if you don't wanna get messy with any of the rice, you can play this game by doing a hide and seek with a puzzle and hide the pieces around the house or your playroom or even the couch and then find them and put them in the puzzle. Today, we'll play hide and seek with our rice. This is some play rice. I'll put it in. All right, now let's dig for our puzzle pieces and find it together. Let's see what we can find together. Digging, digging. Oh, I found something. I found a dog piece. Do you see this piece on the puzzle? Hmm. Oh, yeah, right here. Here we go. Great job. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, I found a rooster. Hey, rooster, he says, cock a doodle doo. Do you see the spot on the board with a rooster? Oh yeah, right in the middle. Here we go. Put it in. Let's see. Let's see what else we can find. Digging, digging. Oh wow, I found a horse. Horses like to go, nay, nay. Do you see a spot on the puzzle board with the horse? Mm. Oh yeah, right here in the left corner. Here we go. Let's see what else we can find. Ooh, a sheep. Here we go. Do you see the spot for the sheep? Oh, in this bottom right corner. Here we go. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, wink, 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 wink. Hi, piggy. Where is the spot for the piggy? Right here. Here we go. How silly. Oh, I found a cow. Moo, says the cow. Do you see a spot for this cow? Yeah, right there. Here we go. 
let's see if we find another piece. <gasps> Hello, duck. Quack, quack. Let's see if we can find the spot. Do you see a spot for this duck? All right, this last one right here. Let's put it in. All right, thank you for helping me. Horse now. Hi, horse. Horse, turn on the lights. Great, fine. <gasps> Make me um, I found a rooster came out. Hi, rooster. I think that's the first thing. She came out of here. Hi, she. Let me see a little piece. The piece is a little pig on it. A from a pig. A pig on it. A pig on it. A pig on it. A pig on it. It's a dog. Hi, dog. And the rest, the tail came out. That's all right. That happens with our puzzle pieces sometimes, huh? Hazel, your darling, oh, you found all of the pieces. Good work. Let put them back in. Let's put them back in. Let's do it again. And do piggy and then do. Good job putting the piggy on the rice. Right. He will hide it. Power hide. Hide. I put the bad word in. Put the word in. Put the word in. Hide. Right in there. There. And dog. And dog. Let's do a fun little caterpillar activity with some pom poms and some cute little caterpillars. Come on. Let's do a fun little caterpillar activity. First, let's count how many faces we have. We have one, two, Three, four, five. And I have these pom poms. How about we build longer caterpillars? This one says one. Let's add one pom pom. This one says two. Let's add two pom poms. One, two. This one says three. Let's grab three pom poms. One, Two and three. This one says four. Let's add four pom poms. One, two, three, four. Whoop. This one says five. Let's add five pom poms. One. Two, three, four, and five. We did it. Look at our cute little caterpillars. Thank you for helping me. One, two, three. Three for this one. Four. Don't forget four. One, two, three. Four. Nice. One, two, three, four. Is it longer? It's longer, yeah. Look, it's, it's almost reaching the end of the paper. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. Here you go, little tea, little mm -hmm. people. Four, Here's another fun activity you can do at home, and all you need is a puzzle and some painter's tape. And what you're going to do is grab some tape, grab your puzzle piece, and tape it to the wall. And we'll tape all of the pieces and then we're gonna play a puzzle rescue where we'll rescue the pieces and put them back in the puzzle. It's gonna be so much fun. Here we go. I got a rhino. Who else we've got? A zebra and a hippopotamus. Let's see what other animals we've got. An elephant. 
Storm, 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 storm. And an alligator. Chomp, 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 chomp. A giraffe! Hello! I've got an ostrich. Here we go. And I have one last piece left. And it's a lion going, Arr! And the pieces say, hello, will you help? rescue us and put us back in the puzzle? Sure, we'd love to help. First, I'll drink some of my water, says baby. Great job drinking your water. And now let's help rescue the puzzle pieces. Are you ready? All right, first, how about we get somebody who goes stomp, stomp, stomp? Who goes stomp, stomp, stomp? An elephant? Here's an elephant. We're gonna peel the tape. Peel. Great job. We'll take the tape off and let's find the puzzle piece. Let's see. Do you see the part with the elephant? Right here. Let's put it in. Here we go. Elephant. Let's get the rest of the pieces. All right. Let's see if we can find somebody with a long neck. Who's got a long neck? Oh, giraffe, giraffe, that's right. Here it is, let's peel it. And we'll put it back in our puzzle. Let's find the spot, let's find the spot. Do you see the spot with the giraffe? Right here, let's put it in. All right, let's see who's next. Ooh, I peeled an alligator, I peeled an alligator. Great job, let's put it back in the puzzle. Mm, oh, here it is, clink. We've got two pieces left. Oh, I see a rhino. Here we go, rhino, put you back in. And one last piece with a zebra. Hi, zebra. Let's put you back in. All right, that was really fun. Let's make a really cute alligator craft together and you can ask your grown up for help if you wanna make one at home. I've got a little oven mitten. This one's green for our alligator. I also cut out some teeth. Chomp, chomp, chomp. A little red tongue. And I've got some googly eyes. Blah, 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 blah. And they're gonna go on to our alligator. And we'll make a cute little alligator with his teeth. All right, let's do it. All right, let's make a cute little craft. First, we'll put on our eyes these little stickies. Here is one eye. the sticky part onto the eye, onto the back of the eye. Here's the sticky, and I'll put it next to our other eye. Look at that, chomp, 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 chomp. And let's put our tongue in here, maybe right over here. Chomp, chomp. Let me get a sticky for our tongue. Sometimes when it's sticky, it can be a little tricky. Tricky when it's sticky. Here we go. And the last part, I wanna put some teeth right over here for our little alligator. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Teeth on. Look at those great teeth, alligator. And we'll do the bottom ones. And we'll stick 
stick this to the bottom. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh wow, look at our cute little alligator we made together. Go chomp, 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 chomp. Oh wow, look at the little alligator friend we made. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Alligator, I really like your teeth. And because we have so many teeth in our mouth, we want to open our mouth really wide when we're in the dentist office. That way they can see our front teeth and all the way in the back and see our back teeth. Our front teeth are called incisors. They're a little bit sharp and pointy and they help us cut the food and cut it into pieces. The teeth in the back are called molars. Our molars are kind of flat and wide and those teeth help us kind of chew up the food and grind it all up. But usually when we smile, we just kind of see our front teeth. That's why it's really important to open up wide at the dentist's office. That way they can see the front and the back teeth. And when, they, when we use a toothbrush, we also want to brush in the front and open wide alligator. Ah, in the back. And with our teeth, we kind of have the front area and the back area. So when you're brushing, it's important to brush, brush, brush the front and brush, brush, brush the back and brush, brush, brush the sides and brush it all around. Because what happens when we eat food, here's some broccoli, yum, 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 yum. Or strawberries, here's a strawberry, yum, 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 yum. Or a carrot, yum, 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 yum. Oh, look at this, our alligator got some pieces of food stuck in his mouth. And we can use a toothbrush to brush it out. Ready, let's brush, brush, brush our teeth. We got a strawberry out. Wow, alligator. Brush up. And a broccoli and a carrot fell out. Brush, brush, brush your teeth. Ooh, looks like we got some strawberry and carrots stuck in the back. Let's brush them out. We did it. We did it, alligator. Great work. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great and counting. Teeth on the bottom. And now let's. Put some food in. I'm gonna have a dental appointment. Hazel, will you see if there's any food in my mouth? Probably a probably and and Oh wow! Do you think you can help me? For you, do the brushing. I pull and all this stuff out. Then I'll do some flossing with this. A body fell out. Another body fell out. Then I will do this for the egg. Put the egg out. Oh wow! Thank you, thank you. Wow, my smile is so bright and clean. Thank you for helping me. That was fun. I see some flowers and the body and the body and some flowers. There you come. It's not open. The food thing now. Thank you. Look at how great my teeth look. Wow. Then you do this. Put all the food in your mouth. And then and I want to wash the big one. See what's in there with my mirror. And then there's my squashy was here. And then the squashy. Then this teeth with this whole bunch of food. Look at the it in. Put these food in. Red, 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 red. I got the broccoli out in mower. Good work. I got the carrot out in front. Out in sizes. Good work. I got it's all thing. Good work. So thank you for helping me. And sometimes when we eat food, little pieces of food get stuck right between our teeth. That's when we want to use a flosser. Floss is a piece of string, really, really thin. It can be attached to a little flosser like this or come out of a floss and you can go between your teeth to brush it out. 
Oh, we can make another fun craft and play with some floss. Come on. Let's make another fun craft with a piece of paper. Some more googly eyes. And some tea. Now we'll stick on some googly eyes. All right, look at our little friend. How cute. Here's this little friend, he says, I'm feeling hungry. I'd like to have a strawberry. Yum, 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 yum. We crush it up with our incisors and grind it up with our teeth and sometimes the food gets stuck in our mouth like this. I'd like some broccoli too. Okay, here you go. Yum, 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 yum. Here we go. And I'd like some carrots and some little pieces can get stuck too. Oh wow, here we go. Let's see if we can help our friend. First thing we can do is brush our teeth. Brush, 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 brush. Oh, looks like with brushing, we got a broccoli out and a carrot. Now let's see. I'll use a little dental mirror. Let's check what's behind here. Oh, I see a strawberry hiding back there. And a broccoli. Oh, wow, you know what I think we need? We might need a flosser. Maybe we can use a flosser like this to go floss, 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 floss. Oh, I think we got a strawberry out between the teeth. Oh, and a broccoli. But you know, our little friend is so big, we'll pretend this yarn is a big piece of bigger floss. Sometimes at the dentist, they use bigger floss and they go right between your teeth. Go brushing it, brushing it up and getting more food that got stuck right between them. Here we go. Flossing, 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 flossing. Oh, wow. Great smile. Look at that little alligator monster. Sometimes also at the dentist, you'll see a tool like this. It looks a little sharp, but they use it for counting. Let's count our little alligator's teeth. One, two, three, up top. We have a little one, two, three, four on the bottom. Great smile. I see them, I see them, I see some flowers, I see a broccoli. Oh, thank you for brushing my teeth. Look at how many yummy foods came out. I can't believe they were stuck in my mouth. Thank you. I'll help you. Thank you for helping 